if we could kind of take a box and put a glue stick and a pencil thing and a whatever else, and we all kind of just give me an eye. We'll just deliver it to the two schools. Uh, that'll be the first thing that we do when we get over there. Uh, my name's Don Champion, a uh, volunteer here at Bayside, and I've been involved with this uh, effort for Africa because I've had some experience in Africa. Uh, so what we're going to do is uh, bless uh, thousands of children in Zimbabwe with uh, Christmas gifts uh, this Christmas. Any more glue? Yeah, my name is Guy Breding. I'm the missions and outreach pastor at Bayside. I'm really excited that we've come together as a church uh, and organized ourselves ready to get the shoebox collected, get all the toys and games and school supplies together at this early stage so we can get the container out there ready to bless these children at Christmas. Christmas in July is a way of uh, getting ourselves organized ready for the Christmas in December, but obviously with the time that it takes for the container to get down to Africa, which could be upwards of two to three months, we need to organize ourselves at this month. Come on, get up. What are you looking for? Santa Claus? Get it up there. Move it. Move it. Move it. Yeah. Move it. Come, on. Come on. Let's go. Yeah. Four branches. Do it. One more. <laughs> well, the container is completely full now, so we're uh, actually in the very last processes of tying it up, getting it ready to be transported over to Miami. Okay. We have a partnership down in the Zimbabwe area with Children's Cup uh, that we've had for several years now. Uh, we've sent short-term missions teams down to that area, building up relationships. And now we're in a position where maybe we can consider something more permanent down there. And, uh, and I'm excited that, uh, that we're starting to develop the relationships at the schools, two in particular down at Carrington Park. And God, we ask that you protect this as it floats across the ocean, as it gets trucked across the ground, and as it arrives in Calgary Park in Bulawayo, Zimbabwe, three months from now. The love of Jesus Christ and His cross. Yes, God, we ask the kids just have a great time, and in some small way, that this changes their lives. Turn their life over to you. It changes their life for eternity, God. Said, Amen. Amen. Come on, let's pray over the food and we'll eat.